All right, audio sync. Hey guys, welcome to day 110 of my weight loss journey. And I am coming to you from, well, my studio, but this is a different change of pace. Welcome to my green screen wall. Um, yes, it's got some wrinkles. Yeah, you know, maybe you're not even tell. I probably have a green screen background. But, um, but in any case, guys, I just wanted to touch base with you, let you know I'm getting ready to do some filming. Um, so I thought, hey, that was a good chance to do and, and make a little change of pace for you guys. I know some of you are like, hey, every once in a while, do something uh, different now besides the same Star Wars studio background. So in any case, guys, I uh, just wanted to let you know today was a good day. Um, <clears throat> man, I, uh, I pigged out a little. I had like a meat stick for early snack because I told you remember yesterday I had eggs so I told you I'd be a little more hungry today but I had a meat stick and then late and then like a couple hours later I had another one of those like what is it like a um it was the it was a pepperoni stick like about this long and and it had what I thought was would would be like mozzarella it was like a white you know square cheese with it and I was kind of in a hurry and I'm like that's fine whatever I looked it was like zero sugars but you know that's not fully true but it was you know it was less enough so I grabbed that and then when I got down the road I looked and I was like this isn't mozzarella this is like American probably plat processed cheese whatever but I ate it you know it was a little treat and then when I got home I made my one pound burger except tonight it's a little different Tonight I did um, a 50-50 blend. So I actually did half pork and half beef today. Did a splash of heavy cream in the meat. I kind of was like, I used a knife and kind of cut it up a little more than the ground beef. The You know, I wanted to make it even more finely cut up ground beef. Because I didn't feel like put it in the food processor. But I put a splash of heavy cream, salt, pepper, garlic, onion powder and um, threw it on the grill and I smeared it almost like icing with the uh, bacon grease and then a dollop of uh, two tablespoons of butter right in the center, closed the lid. It was on the, the outdoor was 500 degrees and then I just let it sear, cook for a while, flip it over once, let finish searing and then when I got to 160 degrees, pull it off and within a minute or two, I started eating. So it was great. I loved it. Um, but yeah, guys, um, coming up as we get into like chapter three, um, right now, as we get to the 120 day mark, what are like what I call, well, yeah, but I mean, once we get to day 180, which is two sets of 90s, right? So chapter one was the first 90 days, chapter two, the second 90 days. And chapter three, um, I figure this is going to be summertime at this point, and I'm going to be in the midst of doing a lot more filming, and I'll be out on locations. So I'm actually going to bring you guys more content, and it's going to be, you know, we'll do carnivore. It's not just going to be, like, because if you wanted to see me in other capacities, I have other media stuff. But as far as, like, carnivore, but, but being in different locations maybe even filming some things. Um, we'll definitely look at doing that. Okay. But for now it's been kind of winter and I'm not doing a lot of locations. I've been focused on my health. So that's why you're going to see a lot of my studio, but I figured since I'm getting ready to do some test footage for an upcoming project, uh, it's, it's an actual new comedy channel that we're going to be doing. Um, I have some friends that all over the world, um, people you may know, uh, people you may not know, but just different people throughout different parts of the world. Um, but me and another friend of mine who lives in Pennsylvania, we're going to be doing some comedy bits. Um, so that'll be fun. And I'm getting ready to start doing some test footage. And we've got um, pretty good, you know, we got some jokes lined up. So we'll see how it goes. I don't know. Maybe it won't be funny. Maybe we will. I'm sure when I get the first joke done, I'll let you guys see it and you guys can tell me if you think it's funny or not. So how's that? <laughs> it's like nothing like being judged. <laughs> but anyways, guys, thank you all so, so much. I hope you enjoyed this update. I, I, I did poop um, recently. So I did poop. 
So, and by the way, in case you guys wonder, this is a real tool when you see this in Hollywood and stuff like that. Again, for those that don't know, this is to help mark the audio, which today I'm wearing a lavalier mic. I'm just in my t-shirt right now. N normally I would be dressed up in, in a costume or an outfit or whatever, but I'm doing test footage. So I'm just wearing my t-shirt, but I've got my lavalier mic. So the audio is recording separate than the video. So this gives a nice spike in the audio on the 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 one that's my, my microphone that plugged in and of course the camera which does have a microphone on the camera but between those audios i can line up the footage with the words coming out of my mouth if you've ever seen where there's like delay and and things look kind of off sometimes things get synced off <laughs> right so anyways just thought i'd spend a quick moment and tell you guys that yes, this is real. These clap clappers are are real. Uh, they have a purpose, and a lot of times too, like because like if you're doing big productions, you'll actually have your file names um, and and you know your director stuff. Because you know if you're doing multiple projects, uh, but you can actually fill this out. So of course, when you show the camera and you and you make your clack again, this way in the editing, you can start lining up the different files with your audio files anyways it's just it, that's all like when you do more complicated type productions anyways but guys i appreciate you oh yeah and you can just clap too if you really if you need a cheap thing just there you go and there's your sink uh, but anyways guys we will see you tomorrow thank you guys so much for all the love and support i really appreciate you guys i think i saw a lot of um support about the duck egg and just comments in general like i said you guys are awesome I, I i love you guys so much and we will see you in the next video bye